here of Yolanda. Let us continue to offer our prayers for our dearly departed, even as we find our own path towards peace, towards healing, towards recovery. The work is not done. There are still many who continue to await our assistance. So we have, uh, we have uh, engaged the Department of Human Settlements and Urban Development and the National Housing Authority to accelerate the provision of housing units and land titles to our beneficiaries. And I also urge the Yolanda response clusters to work closely with concerned local governments to address the lingering issues of the different affected communities. Let us continue to work hard so that we can provide them with the tools and the resources to rebuild their lives. We must make sure that we apply our knowledge on climate change to every plan, to every decision and initiative so we can build stronger and more resilient communities. Be assured that the government is always striving to ensure that such tragedies of this magnitude will be avoided. So we mark the 10th year of Typhoon Yolanda. Let us also celebrate the unparalleled spirit of the Warai and of the Filipino. Let us take pride in the fact that we triumphed over this calamity through our innate bayanihan, which inspired people all over the world. Let us envision, let us dream, let us work towards building a better nation isang bagong Pilipinas in honor of those who have passed on and for the benefit of our future generations.